I guess we're back with Bob. So I've been working him on teaching him to put their feet on there. Dogs are very tactile, so he seems to understand it. The sit's getting a little better. Good, 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 good. And I do want him to start understanding, even though I haven't started doing that with him yet. But what I, what I need to do, what I'm saying to myself, Courtney, is I need to get some control so that he's not always just running and getting it all the time. But that's, and, and the way I do it, because you can do it this way, yay, is I control him around these bop heel with this one in his mouth. Oh, you precious, precious angel. Bop. Yay. Dog in training. try to make it like my hand isn't really that functional anyway that's where I'm at girl that's how I'm kind of getting because no I'm probably not the best author um I, I just threw that in there real quick um I'm probably not the best at adding a bunch of control oh no mommy he'll probably default to it he may go back and get the other one I, I, I would do that that's how the the grandfather, he still is like that, I'm sure. He would just get it and set it in your hand. Let me see if I can just from here. Yeah, no, I was gonna say, I was, I was actually surprised he didn't fall to it. I hit my pager. This dog is like, um, some character from the Adams family. This is our this is what we've thrown in for today's distraction. Bye guys.